of the Unboxers, and today we have for you some Lord of the Rings figures. Yes. The Lord of the Rings figures. This is a two-piece box, two-figure box set, right? Yeah, it's really cool because it comes like the figure, like a, the, it's like, like a, a book. book, yeah. Yes, very cool. So this is the PX Reviews Exclusive San Diego Comic Con 2021 Limited Edition. And awesome. It's, says it's one limited to one of four thousand. Whoa. So we want to say a great big thank you to Diamond Select for sending this to us for free to share with you today. So I guess we're gonna pull the yes. plastic sleeve off and do the reveal. So it untie it ties together like a book. One of those fancy books. Alright. Whoa, I'll hold this side. Teamwork. Oh, look at that. It's actually two figures, and then you get this fancy thing right here. Yeah, like Gollum's little boat. Oh, okay, it's his boat. I was like, um, and what does he do inside there? All right, so let me hold it up here so you can see there's a little bit, obviously, some glare. Whoa, translucent figure. Yeah, so you get um, Bilbo with the, uh, like, wearing the ring so he's invisible, and then Gollum, angry Gollum. And the, and the boat. boat. Very cool. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and get it out of this book so that we can give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. Okay, we're back and they're out of their book box. Book box. Um, we're going to go ahead and take a look at Gollum first. Okay. But um, let, let's take a look at his boat first and then he can take a ride in his boat. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about his boat. It, well, I mean, it's just like a, it looks, looks like, like it's... made of bones and... Yeah, I'm sure it's probably like leather, you know, like he's made it out of... Yeah, it does look whatever like Whatever he's, like, old dinners. Uh-huh. <laughs> he's got some <clears throat> hip bones in there and this in there, skull. And, and it's, really, um, it's, it's tied it's together. Like cool, it's really cool, but creepy. Cool and creepy at the same time. Now, this side is not so creepy. That's yeah. cool. Great craftsmanship, but even to this, the back of this looks cool. Um, but yeah, cool and creepy at the same time, but it's got some good weight to it too. So that's awesome. You can see, oh, it's a little coin tray. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and show you also, this was on that side. You couldn't exactly see that you were going to get it. So it was, I mean, it was a nice surprise. So we have, uh, two other hands, another set of hands, should I say. And one of them actually has the ring yes, in it. Yes, he's actually got the ring. So he is holding the ring. That's his right hand. This one has some pink marks on it. Um, so And the other one does as well, so I'm assuming there's something to that. Um, and then here's this fish. This is a really cool fish. Kind of shiny, shimmery. Green, it's got the little pink and silver underbelly. Um, and he can hold on to it because I had it in his hand earlier. And then, ta-da! Look at his, that face. He's got his non-angry face. <laughs> but it's sideways it is amazing face. how like much detail is in the head sculpt. Yes, it really is. And look at the ear. Yeah. My goodness. Super cool. All right, now on to Gollum himself. Well, you know his whole self, all put together yeah. self. Here's this facial sculpt. A face only a mother could love. <laughs> yeah. And this kind of reminds me, the two facial sculpts reminds me of the, there's a whole section of, of the film where he's like talking to himself. It's like, uh -huh. he's like good Gollum, bad Gollum, and um, he keeps like having, basically like having a fight with himself, and it's like, this is like the, the, the bad Gollum with his, where he's angry, and then the, and then the other one, good Gollum, and the other That's kind of cool, you could almost recreate that scene. Yeah. Um, and then he's got his little um, clothing, and look at those feet. Very cool feet. Um, and, yep, there's his abs, if that's what you want to call them, and ribs <laughs> going on. And he is does have his backbone. So, very cool. Do you want to show off his articulation? Sure. Because I'm sure it's going to be a little different. Okay, so let's see. So you have the neck articulation, and... He can look up. Uh, let's see. No, not really so much down. Um, then you have the the shoulders. They have good range of motion. The elbows and the elbows uh, will twist as well as 
bend and so will the wrists. Um, he has like the mid torso, the hips, like the knees and the knees will pivot as well as bend as well and then the ankles with those big old feet. <laughs> So, very cool. I'm really liking Gollum. Okay, and now it's time for Frodo. Frodo Baggins, yes. So, um, there we go. You you thought you might have called it somebody else. Yeah, I can't remember if I said Bilbo, because they're both... Um, he was clear know. in in the box, so... Yeah. Yeah, now you can tell for but sure. Yeah, if it was Lord of the Rings, it would be Frodo, not Bilbo. Right. Check <clears> it <throat> out. Look at that facial sculpt on that translucent. Very, very cool. Um, and the detailing. Now inside the little, um, some of the joints are like white and it kind of gives it a really cool effect. Yeah. Um, almost like bones inside there. His coat is a little bit, a little bit rubbery and flexible. Definitely has a sword. Yes. It can come out. And it's Look cool because it even has all the detail. It does. Very cool. And so, um, here's the jacket coming around and on the inside the vest um is there another figure like identical to this that is not uh clear, yeah there should be yeah there's there's a frodo is hanging down frodo figure that's just like this that i believe i'm not sure if the jacket has the same uh-huh um but i do know they had the frodo figure that would be the same thing only only not clear <laughs> okay not, yeah yeah so there you go there's this furry feet you can even see the fur on top very cool, and that's where his pants, and then his legs are like super, really clear in that spot, which is really cool. You can see all the folds and everything, and and wrinkles in his shirt and his jacket, even to the buttons and everything. The details are amazing, so he looks really cool. All right, so let's take a look at his articulation. Um, so let's see. So you have the neck articulation. Um, he's, he won't be able to look up because of the, the hair, but he can look down to a certain extent. Um, he's got a good range of, mo oops, he's got good range of motion with the shoulders. Um, he's got the elbow, and the elbow will bend as well as twist. You get the wrist. Um, he does have, um, it's a little hard to see trying to grab it around this coat, but he does have, um, the, you can see like the waist articulation oops that's the waist articulation um, of course the hips the uh, like upper thigh the knees and the ankles and the ankles will roll as well so awesome all right so super cool set of figures from the Lord of the Rings um, they look really cool and the boat very very cool I'm glad they have a separate facial sculpt for him um, yeah. That really makes it cool, and um, I love the translucent, of course. We want to say another great big thank you to... Diamond Select. For sending this to us for free to share with you today. Sure hope, um, definitely if you're a Lord of the Rings fan, you might want to check this set out. Oh, definitely. It is super cool. So thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us, like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.